Hello everyone, welcome to latest update program. The topic of discussion is weight loss injection now in India. Danish pharmaceutical giant Novo Nordisk launched semaglutide as a weight loss injectable in India following the launch of its competitor Terjepitide by Eli Lilly. These GLP-1 glucagon-like peptide 1 receptor agonists have gained attention for their effectiveness in weight loss, helping people shed 15 to 20 percent of their body weight. These drugs also show promise for cardiovascular diseases, kidney disease and other conditions. Semaglutide and tergepetide are now the subject of widespread interest due to their significant impacts on obesity management and metabolic disorders. Welcome SSC aspirants, Drishti SSC is here to support you every step of the way with free live classes, previous year questions, PYQs, demo classes, exam notifications and strategy videos. Whether you're starting your journey or looking to refine your preparation, we've got you covered. Subscribe to our channel and stay updated with all the resources you need to crack your SSC exams. For more details, call us at 87501875. Now let's discuss what GLP-1 drugs are. Semaglutide and tergepetide belong to Gleepy ic receptor agonist, a class of drugs for managing type 2 diabetes and obesity. They mimic gut hormones, GLP-1 and GIP, to regulate insulin secretion, reduce appetite and slow stomach emptying. Semaglutide has been shown to lead to 15% weight loss, while tergepetide offers up to 20% weight reduction. These results are comparable to bariatric surgeries. The drugs help individuals make healthier dietary changes, such as consuming smaller meals. Semaglutide and tergepetide show significant cardiovascular and kidney benefits. Semaglutide, for instance, has been linked to a 20% reduction in cardiovascular events and a 63% reduction in liver fatty buildup. Tergepetide has also been shown to help with obstructive sleep apnea, improve lipid profiles and reduce all-cause mortality. Now let's discuss about its development and discovery. GLP-1 hormones were first discovered in 1986 and their potential for managing diabetes was realized in the 1990s. Novo Nordisk's research on GLP-1 led to liraglutide, followed by more effective treatments like semaglutide and terzepatide. Semaglutide was officially approved for obesity treatment in 2021, while tergepetide continues to gain attention for its extended weight loss capabilities. The drugs have shown neurological benefits too, with potential reductions in the risk of Alzheimer's and other dementias. Now is the time for practice question. What class of drugs does semaglutide and tergepetide belong to? A. Statins B. GLP-1 receptor agonists C. Beta blockers D. Antidepressants Send the answer for this question in the comment section. Thanks for watching. For more informative content, like, share and subscribe and do not forget to press the bell icon to get the notifications.